the details are emerging about the moments right after a Spring Hill family found their loved one buried in their own backyard. The Hernando County Sheriff's Office released the 911 call Sean Eckerd's sister made. In that call, she talks about discovering how her other brother killed Sean and then buried him. It's a story we first brought you last night, and our Chris Martinez continues our coverage. I need to ask, please. My brother killed my brother. The seven-minute-long call to 911 was made by the sister of both the victim and his confessed killer, just minutes after Sean Paul Eckert's family uncovered his body in a shallow grave. Do you see a body part? What do you see? No, the whole body. My dad is over his body right now screaming. The horrifying scene unfolded in the Eckert family's own backyard, where investigators spent much of Tuesday gathering evidence. 19-year-old Sean had been missing since Friday night. Then on Saturday, 21-year-old Stanley was spotted burying something in the backyard. He said it was belongings of an ex-girlfriend, a story the boy's sister just didn't buy. We just dug up the dirt because my brother had dug a hole the other night. So I came to my mom today and I said, I said, Mom, we need to dig up that hole. What's in that hole? And she said, let's go. Investigators now know Sean was strangled. His older brother telling detectives he planned to move the body from the backyard at some point. But why a fight between the boys ever led to murder is something no one can seem to explain. It's really unspeakable, and certainly uh, we, we feel emotionally for the, for the parents and the father who had to make the gruesome discovery that he did. Your father dug up the dirt and he's laying over the person that's in there? He's, he's digging them out of the ground. Oh, my God. 